Hey guys, good morning. Gary G back again for another video. And today I am working on a project that I am really excited about. This is what I would consider a unicorn, a vehicle that I've been wanting to work on for a long time. Let's go check it out. Yep, it's a 55 Chevy. Uh, <laughs> I've always loved these. As long as I can remember, my dad would take me to car shows and all this stuff. These things are just so beautiful. Just gorgeous blue color. Apparently it's it's from an older Dodge Viper. Being that this is a classic car, I'm definitely not gonna use a pressure washer. I'm gonna use a rinseless wash. So I'm probably gonna do a PNS Absolute. That's what I have already mixed up. Get this nice and clean and I'm gonna come in with some new products from Mac Shine. We're gonna get started on this rinseless wash. I am going to be using the Twisted Duo from Mac Shine. I already had about 10 of these. Now I got even more. These are my favorite Twisted Loop drying towels. So I'm gonna go ahead and use that to wipe up the uh, rinseless wash. Normally I would pre-treat the panel with rinseless wash. I'm not gonna do that on this one because I wanna minimize the amount of liquid because the weather seals are not amazing on this vehicle. So it's barely dusty, barely dusty. It's always garage kept. Um, and it was cleaned recently, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go straight in with a sponge and the rinse and swash. Alright y'all, so it's all done. It's all rinseless washed. Everything's been blown out with the Max Shine Mini Blower. Uh, I'm going to do the wheels last, so don't worry about that. I'm going to go back and clean those. I'm going to hit those with a light metal polish. Um, once I'm all done, but everything is looking beautiful. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use the M15 Pro. We're gonna get a little bit better correction. It's a 15 millimeter throw. Let's go ahead and get that going. So let's go ahead and check that. I know for sure this is definitely gonna be a good improvement in gloss. So I'm really happy with that. I'm gonna go with the M15 Pro with that pad, the SEO pad, and we're just gonna keep working our way around it. Let's get it. We're gonna go ahead and get started on this right here. This paint, it's pretty hard paint that they repainted this with. Like I said, this is kind of a DIY paint job, even though it was done by somebody who used to paint cars. It was done in a garage not unlike this one. All right, so I didn't mention it before, but I now have a discount code for you guys through MacShine. I'm really excited to start working with them. If you follow my channel, you've seen I have so much Max Shine stuff. I've just always been a huge fan, so they reached out to me to try some stuff. Um, and I have a discount code now, Stay Slick 15 15% off anything on the store. The only thing you don't get 15% off on, I believe, is the Reaper Polisher, which I wish I got 15% off of that one too. That's the one I want. I actually already did a review on this polisher. This is also Max Shine, so I had this before they actually hit me up. So you know that I love it. You know that it's not a biased review. Mini polisher, this is the 0312. I got the one inch with, this is one and a half, I'm sorry. With the dual action. Put a little 3D one, and I'm gonna start doing these little pillar areas here. Make sure these look good too. I love this little polisher, it's killer. Fresh Lake Country pad going down. Bam! Ready to use it. I already did half of the vehicle with the other pad. Let's get down the side here. Okay, so sometimes in these lines right here, you'll get like some kind of buildup, or it looks like there might be like a little bit of water spots or something right around there. When I use a five inch or even a three inch polisher, I got a lot of stalling. So that's why I like to use the little two inch um, with the DA offset. So 
that's what I'm going to do right here. Get the trigger lock on. You see, I can ride that edge with a soft foam pad and take care of all of that oxidation or anything that's stuck right on there without having to worry about burning any edges. Get the underside here. Now it's nice and clean, glossy, minus any of the gassing from the paint. There was a lot of gassing and different body marks in the paint here, but as you can see, it's nice and clean now. All right, so on with more polishing. I'm continuing to use my M15 Pro. I keep saying this, I've said it for so long. The M15 Pro is just as good as Rupes, as anything else. I've had three different Rupes polishers. I've had all different brands, Griots, you name it. I've had it, and I always come back to the same polisher. It's got all the torque, all the power, all the quality that you would need in a polisher, and I just don't plan to go anywhere else. So do yourself a favor, check it out. It's right under 200 bucks, and you also get a 15% discount code uh, on top of that. So remember, stay slick 15, get you taken care of. All right, guys, polishing is done. Man, she is looking so, so beautiful. So sexy. Came out really nice. I still gotta clean the wheels. That's what I'm gonna do right now, clean up the wheels. All right, so the time has come. We are throwing down Shine Supply Daddy-O. My favorite machine applied sealant. I got it on my SPTA cordless polisher. Okay, so here we go. All right guys, so I'm pretty much all done. I just laid down a Daddy-O paint sealant. You saw it's machine applied. That has to bake in for about 30 minutes. Now remember, everything that I use MacShine in this video, you get 15% off with Stay Slick 15. Just go to MacShineUSA.com. Stay Slick 15 gets you 15% off of every single thing except the Reaper polisher. I know, I'm bummed about it too. The Reaper's awesome. But anyways, Anything Max Shine, make sure you guys check it out. It's great stuff. If you use the links and the code, it does help me out. I am affiliated. Um, but as you know, I love Max Shine. I always have. And I'm finally given the opportunity uh, to work with them. So I got you guys a discount code to help you guys out. Help me out. It's all good. All right, guys. So that's it. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today on this amazing project. I was really looking forward to it. Man, it turned out good. She is looking beautiful. I'm going to go ahead and give you some after shots once I'm able to pull it out in the street, finish the tire shine uh, that are tucked away under here, you can't get to it. So once the customer gets back home, I'm going to pull it out here in the cul-de-sac, show you some final shots. I just want to thank you guys so much for coming back to another video. I appreciate you guys, all the Stay Slick fam. I'll see you guys in the next one, alright? Peace. Stay Slick. Let's get it.